This is Claire and her best friend Jasmine. And here she is, fast asleep, the night before the world unlocks again. After months of being isolated in lockdown and shut away from the world, Claire can finally meet up with her friends and try and get back to normal. Annoyingly, her neighbours are slightly ahead of the game and wake her up at 5am with blaring music. Not ideal, even if it does look like a great party. Claire's a bit annoyed, but then Jasmine phones and asks her if she wants to meet up for a coffee. Despite feeling tired out, she remembers today's the day she can get back outdoors to socialise. So, she dusts herself off and with a spring in her step, gets ready and heads out of the door. The first thing she sees when she gets outside though, is some amateur graffiti sprayed on the wall opposite her door. It's annoying and it's rubbish, but she's off to meet Jasmine, so she'll deal with it later. As she's walking through town, Claire sees that everyone else is getting back to normal too. Sadly, all the inconsiderate people are out in force as well, and as she walks along, one of them throws a plastic bottle out of their car window. It plonks Claire on the head. Luckily, she's not hurt. But why would someone do that? How could they be so inconsiderate? Claire's shocked and angry, but she reminds herself that she's meeting her friend, and so she pushes on. But then her day starts getting worse. As she's about to cross the road, a stream of cars race past, nearly knocking her over. She's shaken and upset. What about what? She'd been looking forward to today for so long and it's being ruined by others. Right on cue, Jasmine messages and Claire's frustration starts to fade away. As she goes on, she has to step over a pile of rubbish that someone's left out. Not pleasant. Then she walks past a pub. There are drinkers out celebrating on the pavement and she struggles to get through the rowdy crowd. One guy's had too much to drink and has left a little sick on the pavement which Claire accidentally treads in. It's disgusting and she's finally had enough. She runs the rest of the way, her day completely wrecked by the actions of other people. Jasmine and Claire are finally reunited, but it's far from the happy reunion she's been looking forward to for so long. It's on all of us to make sure our behaviour doesn't have a negative effect on other people. Even the smallest selfish act can have a huge impact on someone else. So please, now we can be social again, don't be antisocial. Thank you.